Welcome to Let's Play x -Plays Code Embryo, the demo. Oh, God. You don't sound pleased. What is this? We're about to find out. Hey, everybody. Welcome to Pointless Side Quest. This is John. With me, as always, is Nick. I'm confused. As usual. With me, a, in, as... With me in a plurality of videos is Nick. Well, I, I've been demoted from regular, I guess. Well, we 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 need to reach out to other demos, Nick. There's, ah, and I just harmed too many of them. Yeah, I'm afraid so. Today marks a uh, marks a bit of an occasion. This is this is the first uh, pointless side quest that's going to be recorded with my new uh, capture gizmo. I believe that that's the industry term for it. I can capture uh, console games now properly, and to celebrate, we're going to play just. Whatever random detritus I've scraped up off of uh, PlayStation Network recently. It's not as fun as the uh, Xbox Live in the arcade, but well, well, Love well. The thing is, the PlayStation demos there's actually like quality standards and whatnot. I know. <laughs> yeah. You, you you can't just make some really take some really bad 3D models from 1996, put in some you know di dialogue choices and call it a video game. Can't rip stuff from the Sega Dreamcast. Sadly, we're gonna start. We're gonna try out some uh, Sony PlayStation Three demos just to get you know first impressions of them. Now I've got I've got I've got several of them, and I need a way to select one. So Nick, yes, what is your favorite Star Wars movie? Uh, episode five. What is your least favorite Star Wars movie? Uh, episode one. Five minus one is four. If you take nothing else away with you today, folks, take, make it be that. One, <laughs> two, three, and four. Welcome to Let's Play x -Plays Code Embryo, the demo. Oh, God. You don't sound pleased. What is this? We're about to find out. All right. <laughs> There's no save data. Greatness. Saving system data. I have no idea what this is. Well, we've saved, so... Remember, every time you pirate a game, a puppy is fed into a wood chipper. Axis Games. x -Blaze. Code Embryo. Let me know, x -Blaze is super against piracy. <laughs> Arc System Works. What do they do? Oh, Arc System Works. Um, shoot, I did know. It, this did, did they make the first? Did they make the uh, Persona fighting game? I think so. I'm going to look that up. I'll I'll be on the Google today. Uh, let's see. They did indeed make the Persona Four Arena games. They're also responsible for the Guilty Gear, Blaz Blue, uh, fighting games. Um, oh, so this is some sort of fighting game then? Uh, I don't know because they do work on a couple other things. They have the uh, ja the Family series, which is apparently just a bunch of like uh, sports simulators. Well, let's let's take our first. That being a generous term. It's time to take our first step into the unknown, Nick. Yeah. Don't be afraid. I can't help but be. You will be. You will be. Setting. Trust me. Trust <laughs> me. Cut settings. Auto read speed, message speed, window opacity. Animation. Stop, don't stop. <laughs> Stop, don't stop. I've never been a fan of controller vibration. I, I liked it. Uh, it depends on the game and the title and what it's for. Uh, is it really just not tell you what these are? Oh, no, there's a little description below. Turn controller okay. vibration on or off. Determine whether or not to skip new TOI messages. I don't know what that is. Um, sound...
Turn voices on or off when sending a message. Voice. Oh, this is kind of a neat feature. You, I guess you can turn specific characters' voices on or off. Oh, that's pretty cool. Which is, kind of, which is neat if, like, if, if you like most of them, but maybe there's one or two that are obnoxious or whatever. That, that, that's yeah. a cool feature. Yeah, yeah. Well done, next place. I don't know what the hell kind of game you are yet, but... I don't know, this is looking a bit, little bit like an RPG. That would make sense. All those di Yeah, all those dialogue control options. Let's find out. Start. Code Embryo as a title, or a subtitle, kind of disturbs me. I don't know what that means. Traumos any, any... und Schauma! Episode 1, Encounters. Is that German? I guess. Things are all... Where am I? I'm wary of any game that uh, has anything related to babies in the title of it. <laughs> the baby. The baby. <laughs> the baby. baby. Who am I? Who am I? It's no use. I can't remember anything. Whoa! Children of the da we... Children of the Dam dies. Oh shit! I'm Tuya. That's right. My name is Tuya Kagari. CT. Kagari. She's from Connecticut, I guess. I, I guess. Who's that? Oh, okay, we're hearing, like, the cut-off ends oh. of little sentences. Tuya, is that my mother's voice? Oh, God. Mother, protect. <laughs> You're interfering with the drama, Nick. Cut it out. You seen that? Uh, no. I see nothing. How about now? I see it, yeah. No. Okay. Okay. Need to get back to that. Okay. All right. Arc system works. Got JP. Nothing's happening. Yep. I miss the days when um, studios proudly presented. <laughs> I don't see it very much anymore. I think the last time I remember seeing it was when EA proudly presented uh, Red Alert 3. Oh. Well, I guess, okay, I guess it has like a, looks like a modern setting. Yeah. Royal. Or, I don't know, maybe like post-apocalyptic or something? I don't know. It can't be. Whose scenario? I don't... Guy looks like a uh, vampire. Fair. Okay, that was a bit. Oh, I think that was our main. Good lord. Our main character just going crazy there. Yeah. I know this is a Japanese game, but are there any female characters in this game who are not stacked? Not that I've noticed. I'm assuming that guy on the left there is, in fact, male. I assume that was one. Next blaze. Code Embryo.
I hope this is nothing like Conception. Please have my child. <laughs> to ya. Hmm. A dream. I guess I fell asleep. Huh? It sounds like someone's humming. Hinata. The truck. Dot, dot, dot. Hinata. Ah. And Kuya? Good morning. Um, Hinata. Oh, that's right. It's already past four. I guess good afternoon would be more appropriate, huh? I was gonna say, it doesn't look like the morning. Well, that wasn't exactly my point. Tuya is a lazy, lazy man, I guess. Wait a second, did you say four? Crap, you're right. Ron's on at five! <laughs> look at the time. I guess Akira is running late. How, how many ga how many Japanese games over the years have begun with the hero being awoken aw up? All of them. <laughs> Tuya, you have work today, right? Yeah. If you want to leave, I can wait for Akira by myself. Make the offer, but he's supposed to give me some. But really? You don't have to wait around for us, Sonata. I feel kind of guilty for making you hang out here for this long. It's fine, it's actually kind of fun. Now, this game... Nick, I guess you can't really hear this, but the, the game does have sp uh, voice dialogue. It's uh. all in Japanese. There didn't appear to be an Eng oh, okay. There didn't appear to be an English language option that I could see. That sounds par for the course with Arc System Works. Well, that wasn't my point. Oh well. Glad to see you're enjoying yourself. Who are these people? I don't know. She just said it's fun to sit next to some dude who's asleep. There's a save? Auto save. We hit a checkpoint, Nick. A toy? Huh? A new alert from capital T, capital O, lowercase i. Let's see here. View the... Put on stupid goggles. View the TOI tutorial. Hello there, everyone! Welcome to the cutting edge of information gathering technology. You look puzzled. Ha ha ha! Don't worry, using it is a breeze. It's spelled T O I, but is read as toy, as in, it's easy to use as a toy. Why, doesn't that sound like fun? So let me share with you the joys of toy. They're, 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 re oh God. they're really hard selling you on the game's interface. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Maybe you want to look something up, but are too lazy to search for it. Does that sound like you? It does, doesn't it? It kind of does, actually, if our hero is asleep at four. <laughs> well, that's where Toy comes in. Well, Is it like, let me Google that for you? <laughs> While you're sleeping, eating, or trying to learn corner combos, Toy will aggregate info about things you're interested in. Amazing, don't you think? From now on, Toy will deliver to, to you all kinds of useful information. Open articles immediately, or just outright ignore them if they don't tickle your fancy. It's great in that you- Then it's not really- It's not really doing what it just said. It said it would be looking for things I'm interested in. It's great in that you can use it however you want. I mean, this app is made especially for you. No, really, it was. Totally just for you. Oh! There is just one tiny piece of information that you must know. Do not feed it after midnight. Also, depending on which articles you read, or don't read, the course of the story, or even its very outcome, can change. Oh ho! Seems like Toy has already started gathering information just for you. Ha ha ha! Isn't that awesome? It is, isn't it? Admit, admit it's good! Admit it's good, damn you! Why didn't you love me? <laughs> my, my daddy! <laughs> he held the R and she was... <laughs> Too long didn't read. Okay. Choosing to read or not read an article has a very real effect on the story. Hopefully you understand that. Well, enough luxury. Try toy out for yourself. Okay, so this so this program is going to I guess it it'll, it gathers data based on our past preferences. So I guess what we read will affect what else it shows us, and that will affect the outcome of the plot. Yeah. Try toy. I guess. I don't know if it gathered stuff on me. It would be a lot of really really useless information. Just the weirdest porn you can imagine. Yeah, yeah, and that, and you know, wrestling, 
and then wrestling porn. One night in China. Oh god. <laughs> oh. With Sean X Pac Williams. And then, and then, if 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 the thing ever like developed into sentience after that, it would probably just destroy humanity. <laughs> okay. Let's find out who the hell we are. Profile: Tuya Tagari, Hakuo student. Is it Hakio or Hako Hakio? You. I'm H. Oh, we're high school. H a k u o u. North of Canada. Okay. Well, it's like how they call it Tokyo U, Tokyo U. Oh, do they? Okay. I. I'm not as up to date on Japanese academia as perhaps I should be. That's. Well, I, that's what I was told back like seven years ago. Okay. Well, <laughs> let's see what's going on here. Tuya Tagari, gender, male, age, 16, height, 173 centimeters. I'm, I'm not sure what that is off the top of my head in real units, so I have to look that up. It's like, <laughs> in real units, it's like 5'9", I think. Okay. I'm like 180 centimeters. No, five, Wait, five, 59 five, kilograms. I, I've, just, I've just alienated the entire metric using demographic, which is like 1920th of humanity, so that was probably not a good choice on my part, but I... <laughs> real units. I apologize for nothing. 